courtesy of those who like to hit the send button, the most emailed story at the LA Times right now is an op-ed titled, The Queen of Nice Goes Nuts. Their title, people. The Queen refers to comedian Rosie O'Donnell. Columnist Jonah Goldberg writes that Rosie should be removed from the daytime talk show The View. His beef? Her recent rantings about 9-11 conspiracy theories, about it being an inside job, and her poetry on her blog about the British soldiers being held in her, by Iran as somehow being a setup of some kind. Specifically, Ms. O'Donnell implied that explosives may have been involved in the collapse at the Seven World Trade Center building on 9-11. So what is a huge media corporation to do? about one comedian's conspiracy bent. Bill O'Reilly says she should be fired. Steve Vitalio is a senior correspondent with TV Guide. And so what should ABC Disney consider as they handle Rosie O'Donnell and her outspoken ways and all these mini dust-ups? What do they need to think about in terms of her future and The View's future? Well, I can tell you what they're thinking about. They're thinking about signing Rosie to a new contract. Uh, the, the ratings are up, people talk about this show all the time, and it's, it's getting a lot of attention. I don't see any downside so far. When you talk about Bill O'Reilly ranting against Rosie, I think you should think about what he said about NBC News. He said that NBC News has had a, uh, had a, a bias against the president and uh, against the war in Iraq. Uh, I ask you, has there been one moment of reflection uh, about that since Bill O'Reilly said all those things about NBC? Are you going to make me take the fifth on cable TV right now? <laughs> well, no, I, it's just that, you know, this woman was hired to express her point of view uh, on television, to make this show more exciting, uh, and she's saying what she thinks. It's an entertainment program. It's not a news program. Uh, and, by the way, people on cable news say nutty stuff all day. In fact, if you stripped away the nutty stuff that people say on cable news, you'd end up with C-SPAN. So let's talk about this news issue, though, because obviously this show is run by Barbara Walters, a veteran journalist. Does she have some sort of responsibility here, or maybe a better way to put this is, could this uh, reflect badly on her that she lets Rosie O'Donnell stay on the show and continue to go on with uh, what some people I say are offensive? I repeat, Barbara is one of the all-time great television journalists. But The View is an entertainment program that competes with things like Jerry Springer, Maury, uh, Who's the Daddy on Montel, uh, on Montel. I mean, all this other stuff that's on in daytime. Rosie is is wacky, but she's just wacky in a different way in terms of the in the world of daytime television. How about this, though? Curious thing is, a lot of what O'Donnell says, much of what she says, it's just controversial. Shows up on her personal blog. Has that become an issue at all for networks when people make comments or say something in cyberspace, which really doesn't have anything to do with what they do in their regular job during the day? You know, I think I think the network, and I think Barbara talks about Rosie and what she says on the air all the time. Uh, her blog is her personal thing, and I, and I know that, on, that people think that people are on computers reading blogs all day, but they're really not. And that's her personal forum. Uh, I think it goes into the, the news cycle and the echo chamber the rest of the day that, you know, th this show talks about it, conservative talk radio talks about it, O'Reilly and Hannity and Combs talks about it, but, you know, the average person who likes Rosie or doesn't like her probably doesn't care that much. All right, Steve Battaglia says Rosie's staying. Steve, thanks a lot. Sure.